Hey everybody. It's Saturday the 29th and um, I'm back. <laughs> I'm sorry I haven't been um, to see you guys in a little while but um, my husband and I went to Michael's today and um, I got a little haul I'd like to share with you. It's um interesting little haul. They had a 70% um, off of Christmas decor and um, I picked up a few things so I just thought I'd share with you what I got. And I think I'm going to start just the way th that it was rang up. It's probably the easiest way to do it. Um, starts with some ribbon that I got. I love this. I don't know why, but for some reason, I love the deer stuff this year. I have um, made a lot of things that include the deer with the antlers. But I found this ribbon. This ribbon was $10, and 70% off that made it $3. So I got this, um, I think, let's see, there's... Uh, 25 feet of ribbon on here but I thought it was really pretty and then I got this mesh sort of a silvery gold mix uh, glittery wired it's really pretty same thing 25 feet for ten dollars so I made it three dollars and then this is kind of a whimsical little thing. Christmas tree ribbon. My daughter has, I think she's talked me into um, opening up, like everybody in the free world, an Etsy store. So I'm trying to um, get a few things together to try to do that. Um, I made I made some wreaths this year that she thought were pretty enough that I might could sell them. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how they turn out once I start making them. Anyway, all three of these were $10. And I guess, and they're all the same length, 25 feet. So, that made them all $3 a piece. So, I thought that was a pretty good deal. And... The next thing I found, believe it or not, was Diamond Dots. I found the Snowman and the Holiday Road. And normally these things are $32, and I got them for 70% off. Can you do the math real quick? <laughs> I couldn't. <laughs> $9.60 a piece. So I grabbed them both. These were the only two they had left. I don't know if there was, is there, is there another Christmas one? I don't even remember. But I went ahead and grabbed them both because I have not, I have not bought one of these this year, a Christmas one. So, um, yep, I got them. And I think I'm going to go ahead and do them because I'm going to go ahead and do them and have them ready for next year. So I was happy about that. $9.60. So if you guys have a Michaels anywhere near you, they're having their 70% off. So if they have any of these left, you might want to grab them up. Let's see, what's next? Oh yes, my pretty little perfume bottles. Look at these guys. These were on the Christmas, um, these were Christmas too. It's tabletop decor, but they're little perfume bottles. I thought they were really pretty. I hope this is not, is this too dark? Is everything too dark today? I hope not. But these are really pretty, I thought. My daughter gave me a light to help with filming. I hope things are... 
this, of course, it's night time, so things are supposed to be dark, but not this dark. <laughs> but these are pretty. There was another style, a square, squared off bottle, but I didn't care for it too much. These are pretty. These were originally, um, let's see, $14.00. And they were four dollars and twenty cents after the discount. So I grabbed a couple of these. And then um, I got this coiled garland. It's got the berries and the. Um, Pine cones. It's got a little bit of flocking on it. And it's got some little beads on it too. That's $12.99. And then um, with the discount, it made it $3.90. So I thought that was cute. And I got this, just this little plain wreath. It looks like it's got ice on it. And it's got some little snow cones, snow cones, <laughs> yeah, pine cones. A couple of little pine cones on it. And it was uh, $12. So let's see, it made it $3.60. I don't know what I'm going to do with this stuff. Probably I may cut some of it apart and use it for uh, decorating different other things. I don't know. I never know what I'm going to do with the things that I get until I start decorating things, other things. Let's see. Um... I found these little feather picks. They're just little picks. They were a dollar twenty after the discount. They were three ninety nine originally. Made them a dollar twenty each. I got. I think I got four of these. Yeah, I did. I got four of those. And I got a little. Lollipop. It was also three ninety nine, so that made it a dollar twenty. And here's the deer again. Got two of these. A little glass. It's actually plastic, but I'm sure it's breakable. I have to be careful. It was actually four ninety nine to begin with. So it was a dollar and a half. I got two of these. They'll definitely come off the pick and be decoration on something, probably a wreath of some sort. These are pretty, I thought. And the lockables, the craft mate lockables, they are originally $19.99 and they're on sale. For $14.99 and I went ahead and got two of those I didn't see but two on the shelf so I went ahead and grabbed both of them both the ones they had and I made sure and check them real good and make sure there was nothing wrong with them because one time I picked up one and something was broken so but there's nothing wrong with these you have to be careful. I mean, you have to look at things nowadays. You can't just grab them and go. I got two of these. And got a couple of a couple of picks. I have two just like this. These were ten dollars each originally. I thought they were really pretty. I figure I can um, spray paint these maybe a different color 
because I did that with one of my uh, wreaths. I took a poinsettia flower and I didn't like, I, I needed it to be a different color for the wreath that I made, so I took it outside and spray painted it teal because I had some teal in the wreath and it turned out really pretty. But these were $3 a piece after the discount. So I thought they were really pretty. I've got imagination. I can do what I want with those. Don't have to leave them that color. Definitely. And I bought, I think I bought two of these also. These were $10 originally also. It's just soft pine sprigs. Just the stem. And I got a couple of these. Um, just about all of these long. Um, Stems, as they're calling them, are were ten were ten dollars. This size, anyway, um, they were ten dollars originally. So everything winds up being three. But these I thought were pretty. Some of the berries have come off, but they're in <laughs> they're in the bag. I've saved them, so if I need them, I'll put them back on. They were pretty though. And a couple more things over here. It's just those stems that I have the same kind of. I got. This one was nine dollars originally. It's really sparkly. It's really pretty, I think. And like I say, if I don't want to leave it white, I can always spray paint it a different color. That's why I went ahead and got two, just in case I decided I wanted to do that. I can. So nine dollars made this one those 270 and then this one was all was six dollars isn't that pretty it's like a big huge rose so this one was six dollars and that made it a dollar eighty so i got two of these aren't they pretty they're called lavender sparkly Looks like they have ice on them too. And I got one big huge, looks like a magnolia leaf or something. This was also $9 originally. It's really soft though, it's very soft. Very soft material. I don't know what they made it out of. And then one more little pick. And I kind of wish I had gotten more than one of these because I have some of these, um, had some of these in the past and I've used them up in some decorations that I've made. But um, it's more of a metallic rose. Two, two metallic roses and then the leaves but they're really pretty it was seven dollars originally so that made it two dollars and ten cents so I don't wish I had gotten more than one of these but it's okay I'll, I'll probably find another one at, I actually went to a Michael's uh, one town over from where I live and that Michaels is a lot bigger than the one where we live. So, um, 
maybe I'll find some. Either I'll go back to that Michaels or I'll, maybe I'll find some at our Michaels here if I go. So, well, that's all for the Michaels haul. But I actually have been needing to um, do an unboxing. I have a few. Um, a few paintings that have been sitting here waiting on me to film. And if you guys don't mind, I'm going to go ahead and do that while we're here. I'm just going to put everything to the side over here so I can have room to open the box or open the bags. Everything moved over. Okay. All right. I don't recall. We already opened the red bottom. Did we not? I think we already did that. So. Let's get her out of the way. And I have, I don't know why I can't control myself. Diamond Art Club is my downfall. I cannot control myself. I have ordered two more paintings and I think they'll probably be here very soon. Um, I haven't gotten an email though, so I'm not sure when they're gonna be here, but it shouldn't be too much longer. I've ordered the Revealing Woman and, um, oh, what was the other one? Oh, shoot. Can't remember what the other one was. Come on, Lisa, you can remember it. I'll think of it in a minute, I'm sure. All right, I know that AliExpress is chomping at the bit to have me let them know that I have received these. So, as soon as um, I'm done with this, I will let them know that I have received these diamond paintings. Excuse me, I needed a drink. Okay. I think I know which one this one is. Okay. Just out of the way. is that book with all the butterflies coming out of it. <laughs> and it's not quite, it's a partial of course, but it's okay. I, I've always wanted this one. I've wanted it for a long time, but I haven't, I've never ordered it. I don't know why, what made me order it this time, but um, it shouldn't take long to do. You see it without too much glare. Can you see it at all? <laughs> I don't know how to do better. Yeah, after I've not done one for a while, then it just takes all I've got to redo, doesn't it? Yeah, let's see. I don't know, can you see it? Maybe you 
can there. Alrighty. It's a little, maybe I need my glasses on, but it looks just a little dark. It looks a little bit cloudy to me. I don't know. As you can see, it's from DIY 5D Dimensional Diamond Painting. I don't know who they are, but um, anyway, it has 18 colors. And they're all packaged in here, it looks like. And we have a single pin with a boat with no funnel and some wax. Okay. That's all of that. So I've got 18 colors in here, and that'll be all I'll do for this one. Yeah, here's 18. Oh, by the way, I finally finished putting away all of my round drills that I received. 447 round drills that I received. I finally finished putting those away. And um, I, I believe that they sent me all that I was supposed to get, but you know, there's still one or two that I swear. I don't, I don't know, I'm, I'm not sure if, if I was supposed to get them or if, I don't know. I know I sound crazy, but I don't know if, because there's a, there's one color in the 3800s that said 3342 on it. But then there's not a 3342 on the chart, but there's a 3842. I don't know. I'm not sure if it was maybe a misprint or what it was. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to put those back in there. That makes too much noise. Right, I'll put that there. Right, let's see what's in here. This says that there's two in here. Some gold tweezers, at least. Alright, I've got two boats with, two white boats with funnels, two pairs of good tweezers, and some multi-placer ends, some three-placer ends. Blue grippies. Okay. Um, this one is the, um, this one is the horse-drawn carriage in the snow. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. I'll open it up. Um, number 1317. This is a 30 by 40. And then this one is the... Butterfly. You guys know I love butterflies. This is one that Brandy did, Abstract Crafter. This is the one she did, but I'm sure hers was a lot bigger than this. This is a 40 by 30, and it's got 40 colors. So, let's see. Get these open so we can make sure everything is 
could with the canvas. Oh, almost lost the thing in the floor. Sticky tape. Things up. You can see the horses. Pretty clear. Yep, that's going to be pretty clear. Pretty, I think that'll be good. Have a great big huge block of color to work in. That's all right. I don't care one way or the other myself. I just enjoy working on them. Extra careful, don't tear anything. Yeah. No, 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 no. Stay there. I don't want you to come up with the paper. I want you to stay where you are. Come on. That's right. And flat. Alright, now you can see the thumbnail a lot better. Isn't that pretty? It's going to be pretty, pretty, pretty when I get done. Yeah. It's going to be very pretty. Can you see that? Can you tell what it is? Yeah. 
we're already 30 minutes into this video, so I'll do the be I'll check, I'll do the inventory off camera. Just want to check this canvas here. what it's going to look like. Oh, this. Yep. There is a lot of canvas on either side. The 40 by 30, 40 colors. All right, let's see. Gave me an awful lot of canvas for... No, I don't know if it's that much canvas or that much picture. I hope you guys didn't hear that. That was my stomach rattling. Really? Come on, what the, what the problem? Looks like it's going to be very clear, very pretty. I like it. I mean, it's going to be a good size. I don't know what all those dents are in the. <laughs> what are those? That'd be okay. Okay. Push this back down. Right. Do this side. So flat. I have to fix that. Why didn't it lay down like it was before? Why do they do that? I want to know why they do that. Why do they come up? 
Why don't they lay back down like they're supposed to? <laughs> All right. Uh, like I said, I'll do the inventory off camera. Well, thank you guys for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this. I really enjoyed showing you what I bought at Michael's. And I hope that you guys can find some good deals there too. Um, I'd like to leave you guys with a thought. Something to think about. And, um, and just know that uh, everything happens for a reason. And that... Everybody loves somebody sometimes. Everybody please have a wonderful evening, morning, day, afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you're watching. And uh, I hope to see you in the next video. Bye guys.